Hello fellow homo sapiens. This is David Seymour. I'm your host for lifers. And today we are here in uh, Baltimore County, Maryland to see what we can find. It's mid July, pretty hot. And uh, yeah, let's see what we can find. Let's go. Whoa, check this out. I'm not sure what flower this is. I'll figure it out together. There it is. Look at this, guys. I think it's a. Uh, I don't know what kind of fly that is. All right, let's keep moving. All right, I found a moth here. If I can get close enough to it. I'm pretty confident that's a different species that we have not found yet. Let's see if we can get him. Can we get him? I'd say so. It's not the best image in the world, but beautiful. All right, let's keep moving. All right, guys, I see some uh, hummingbirds. It might be pretty hard to get with this, but I'm going to try. Look at how beautiful this is. Whatever this plant is, I haven't I haven't figured it out yet. You guys will probably know before I do. I just saw a couple hummingbirds. A lot of times they perch right above where they're feeding. So maybe I'll get lucky. Now, we only have one species of hummingbird around here. The ruby-throated, the ruby-throated hummingbird. Yeah, I'd say the Northeast got the bad end of the deal with uh, hummingbird biodiversity, but we'll take what we can get. I see, I see where he's perching. So it'd probably make a good idea for me to wait there. I see where he's perching. I see him. He just flew off. But if he comes back there, I think I should wait for him. I hear him. You hear that? I'm going to wait for him because uh, that's definitely a bird I still need for the list that we need. There he is. There are a ton of hummingbirds right here and hummingbird moths. I see one right there.
All right, so I had to take a break from hummingbirds because they're really fast and frustrating. Same with the hummingbird moths. So I moved a little bit further down. I found this flower here. Let's see what this stuff is, hopefully. And as always, let's hope it's native. Let's hope uh, we can identify it. It is. It's pretty cool looking. There's a little ring neck snake I just saw. I don't know if I can get him before you. God. A little ring neck snake. It's feisty. See him? I'm gonna let him go. We found enough of him. There you go, buddy. Okay, so I just found this other plant here. Some kind of yellow flower. Not 100% sure what it is, but hopefully we'll figure it out. Now I see another plant right here. Might be like a native sunflower, maybe. So we're gonna try and figure out what this is too. Beautiful. Look at that. It's about as tall as I am. Look at this guy. guys I saw I just saw a bush cricket over here there he is let's see if we can get him maybe he'll cooperate with us Sitting still. That is a bush cricket. Now I'm not sure how many species live around here. Now this looks like a nymph. It doesn't look like a fully developed adult. So it might make it even harder to identify. But I just want to show you guys another example of life's biodiversity it's beautiful let's try to get a little video of them all right i found these little uh this little party going on here not sure what what they are Thank you. 
All right, guys, that does it for this episode. Um, well, we found a hummingbird. It might not have been the best footage, but we got it. Um, and we also got the uh, hummingbird moth, if we can identify the species level. I want to get a species level for those, so if we don't figure it out, I always come. I can always come back and try to find some better, get some better images. So, all right. See you next week. What's on your list? Thank you.